Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the last couple of days, I've been letting you know about the new Chrome OS global media controls that Google has been working on in Chrome Canary 123, where they have been working on the new material you redesigned you are for global media controls in Chrome OS, which now is finally starting to roll out in Chrome Canary 123 on Windows. Now, I'll leave that previous video down below if you would just like to get more info. But just to let you know that it seems now that Microsoft is wanting to bring the same uh, material you redesigned Chrome OS Global Media Controls into Microsoft Edge for desktop. And currently in Edge Canary um, 123, which is the latest preview version, the same feature more or less is now available. And yeah, we can see the material you redesign. You can obviously control your music by play, pause, using the button. You can enter picture in picture mode. And yeah, we get the timeline with the Q button. And I actually quite like that little synth wave, sound wave, little feature, that little tweak there. I think that gives it a nice little touch for want of a better word. So looking very similar to what we get over in Chrome Canary. Now, this is not a default feature in Edge Canary 123. It's actually still very early days because it seems that Microsoft can't really make up their mind if they want the global media control in Edge for desktop or not because they've removed all flags of the um, global media control from the stable and the preview version. But this is enabled using a command line flag um, from the actual uh, properties, the shortcut properties um, from the actual shortcut of Edge Canary. And this is the command line flag. Enable features global media controls updated UI. Now I'll leave this down below if you are wanting to try this out in Edge Canary. It's not available as it in the stable version. It's still very early days, but is a good indication that um, Microsoft could be thinking of reintroducing the global media controls, which I know a lot of you, including myself, are looking out for. And I think it'll be a nice touch if they do bring the new Chrome OS uh, visually redesigned tweak and adjustment into those uh, media playback options. So how we enable a command line flag is we right click on any shortcut for Edge Canary and we head to properties and in the target, yeah, you'll see, now I've already done this because this is very temperamental. It's still very early days and this is only working on Edge Canary on my Windows 10 device and not Windows 11 because sometimes these work and sometimes they don't with these command line flags. But nonetheless, after the .exe quotations in the target, you leave a space and you enter the command line flag. You paste it in once you've copied it from the description. You click on apply, you click on OK, and then you have to restart um, Edge Canary. And then obviously, as mentioned, you will then get access uh, to the new material you visually redesigned global media controls and just take note though that is very temperamental so it may not work it may not work i was fiddling around quite a bit to get this to work then something else to take note of um, is that for chrome canary they matched up the theme of the browser in the actual um, global media control and just to see if this will actually work as well in um Edge Canary. Let's head over to our appearance and let's just change the browser theme to another color. Let's see if it actually picks up that theme when we are playing media. So let's just head out of there. Let's head to our media controls and it seems that it has picked up a little bit of the theme in some of the little elements but not like it is in chrome canary where the whole ui changes to the browser theme so obviously it's still early days a lot of work to do but putting it out there that um this could be a feature that could be returning to um, microsoft edge for desktop and obviously i'll keep a close eye on this one and i'll keep you guys updated if something more substantial becomes available regarding this feature so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one